Hi, everybody! PowerCode is with you again, and we continue to present our exciting projects and introduce incredible people to you. Today we will go on a voyage and find out how our custom mobile application can help recreational boaters sail everywhere without worrying about handling birds. Our guest knows about all the boaters' difficulties not by hearsay. He is passionate about the sea and ocean at any time of year. This person enjoys a fair wind and boldly and confidently leads his business ship forward regardless of weather conditions. Please welcome Robert Mertens, a captain and founder of Moringo AB. Nice to see you, Robert, here. Thank you for uh, finding time and joining us today. And uh, firstly, uh, we would like to know when and how you decided to create such an application as Moringo Breeze. Yes. That was uh, creating Moringo from start was already uh, that was actually here on my boat in uh, 2015. I at that time I, I was working as a computer consultant uh, for different companies and I thought I all I did was like just automating things uh, and uh, uh, making people get unemployed. Just uh, so I thought uh, I should do something that I really want to do, and uh, with with uh, being out on the boat, I I felt like kind of stress that um, that I didn't really know where to go. There was not enough data on uh, destinations, so I thought I can solve this uh, problem. I know how to program and I know boating, so I thought uh, I need to, just need to do something mm, with my uh, yeah. So, it's a perfect uh, con combination. <laughs> yes, it's like yeah, I want to contribute to uh, other people uh, on the boats, uh, using boats, because I think it's a nice environment to be out there on the on the ocean, and then it shouldn't you shouldn't be stressed. Like, uh, mm. agree. Yes, so that that's what uh, that's when I figured let's do it, and at the same time I had some money uh, back then uh, because I sold a. Uh, part of I went I, I left the company I was a part owner in, so I got some money and I thought well let's invest it in into Moringo. So yeah, that's it's uh, been working on it ever since. since. Mm -hmm. Knowledge, money, time. <laughs> yeah, that, that, everything. that's what I that's what I had exactly. But you know when you start a company, it's not the time is just uh, it's just has a lot of time. Uh, spent on, on developing stuff uh, and, and so on, so definitely. And uh, yeah, we started out. I uh, started out with uh, uh, employing <coughs> former colleagues that I knew were good at uh, uh, with the app development and so on back here, up here in Sweden. And uh, uh, yeah, that, that was a good start. I mean. Uh, but it was not as professional then, uh, back then, as it is uh, now. Um, well, um, yeah, but still, uh, it's okay to work for me if I can work from the boat. Uh, it's not, you know, you really don't know if you work or if you are on holiday. That's good. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, as I know, the market for navigation and boating application is rather vast. Uh, so why should I, as a boater or a harbor, give preference to your solution and what makes it stand out from your competitors? Yes, uh, good question. My, I mean, Moringo is, is coming from the point of view of the boater. So for a boater, we are, have like a, it's like a complete view of all the destinations that uh, you would like to visit. Not only the destinations that we have which are affiliated with us. I mean, uh, many competitors, they, they show only the marinas and harbors that uh, are connected to them and they don't show the rest, but we show all the different marinas and also anchorages. Um, and we also link to, to uh, competitor booking systems uh, to make it easier for boaters to uh, move around and book ahead, book ahead and so on. Uh, if we look at the marinas themselves, our, we, we are 
a very flexible uh, booking system that we deliver for free to uh, to both marinas and boat clubs, uh, but also seaside restaurants and private people. Anyone with a vacant berth can market it through our system and there is no strings attached. It's for free and if they want to stop using it, it's uh, they can do it anytime. And uh, so far, no one has. So that's uh, that's. I think that's a good. Uh, that, that's good. <laughs> yes, really, it sounds great. <laughs> so that's that's why it's more like. Uh, I think it's like very complete for the boaters to move, to use our system and find a, a proper destination. Mm -hmm. Thank you. How about your history? So I know that uh, Moringa Breeze has a rather long history. Uh, if we compare a previous application with the current one, um, what has been changed and uh, are you going to develop it further to change something? Yes, uh, we started out with the with Moringa Classic, which is like kind of a booking system. Uh, which are yeah, kind of making it possible for anyone to, to book anything around. And then we, we realized that it's going to take some time to get all these, uh, you know, everyone on board to, to make this really valuable. So we started to make Moringo Breeze instead, which is more focused on delivering data to, uh, to boaters, where we, in, in this particular uh, app uh, now the last one the Moringa Breeze we're using satellite uh, data to <clears throat> analyze marinas and anchorages vacancy so giving you a forecast on uh, on how it will be on Saturday anywhere uh, you, you along the coast and uh, so that's a big difference and we want to develop it further to May give more data to boaters. For instance, um, would be interesting to see maybe uh, observations that um, that people have seen while you are out sailing. You might see a dolphin, or you might see something special, and you can report that in the app. And then someone else could uh, see that information. So when you when you are coming uh, on Saturday, you would see on the map. Uh, Someone has uh, seen, uh, did see a very rare dolphin here two days ago. That's really interesting. So giving this data to make boaters understand the context uh, on uh, in, in, in the area where they're sailing, that's what we're going to develop further. And how yes. about harbors? Do you have any plans to maybe to improve for, for harbors or only for boaters? No, no, no. We are definitely also uh, still uh, working on, on the classic Moringo uh, at the mm -hmm. same time. And uh, all the time. So that, that's our biggest and, and the core cool. value that we deliver. That making it possible to book marinas and any destination ahead. And, and that it's really something that is coming. And But, you know, it's only a fragment of uh, marinas that are bookable online. And uh, it's like, it has to be hotels. You would never go anywhere now to a city or something with, without booking a hotel in advance. You don't, you don't just go to a city and, and, oh, look at that hotel, let's go there. No. No. <laughs> so and it, it's a natural thing that has to, 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 um, to, to uh, yeah, that has to arrive. I mean, the pre-booking that makes people really be able to relax and you can plan your trip <laughs> so we're going to improve we're still going to improve for marinas to join our system and, and uh, make it easy mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, i see thank you and the last but not the least <laughs> i'm sure that uh, our viewers would be interested in hearing your impressions uh, about cooperation with power code team <laughs> What do you think? What do you like? <laughs> yeah, I, I can say exactly as I, I started off, when we started off the app, I did it with friends and it was like, let's just program something and uh, get it on the market. And uh, 
and uh, you know that that really doesn't work anymore i mean uh, now it's so much on quality and uh, really focus on your features you don't want to have any bugs and so on so i realized quite soon that we need to have professionals helping us i'm a programmer myself so i do a lot of programming of course on the server side but i don't have experience with uh, uh, graphics and uh, ux design and uh, and, and uh, app programming so with power code i mean uh, it's been really nice to work with you because uh, you are like uh, our you're our development team and uh, that is something I, I really want to have, especially as a, like, as a startup. We, we might have like, our income is like this. Sometimes we have no money and then we have money and then we, you know, it's like that. And that's it's really <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. And then it's really nice to, to, to work with you and, and get you going. Uh, and, 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 and it's like really professional. And uh, I feel like you are our development team, which uh, we didn't have uh, the same feeling. We had a, a previous partner and they just did what we told them to do, but there was no responsibility for or no feeling for what we were trying to achieve, which I think uh, it's been uh, great to work with PowerCode because you are really helping out. So the app has been much better than I expected, actually. <laughs> Thank you for such words. <laughs> no, no, that, that's, it's such that's a true. pleasure, really, yeah. <laughs> to hear. And we tried our best and we are trying our best. And of course, we are looking forward to our further and fruitful cooperation. Yes, that, that's wonderful. And I think it's going to be a long cooperation. We will now, we have tried this now uh, with the um, satellite uh, the new moringa breeze and satellite prediction in sweden and now we're going to expand all over the world because satellites they they move around the globe so we can start anywhere so we have a lot to do we we are our next step now is to start up in new zealand so we are working on that currently and uh, we probably need to make some local adapt the adapt the app, app for some local specialties of course because they have something different than we have so that's going to be fun and then after new zealand it's going to be some other country mm -hmm. so great thank you so much for being with us today it was a pleasure it was it was so great to have a chat with you Thanks, and Anna. the most important phrase that i learned while working with you and your project is like fair wins Fair wins, yes, that is fact. <laughs>